What's up YouTube? This is Amo and in this tutorial I want to show you something very important in Laravel which is master page. So basically in every website uh, there are some parts that actually are repeated in every pages. For example this is Laravel official website and as you can see in the footer section uh, the footer area is repeated also in the documentation page but the main content of web page is different but this footer is the same so you don't have to write every code in every pages by PHP code you can do this uh, with include and requiring but in Laravel uh, there is a very good way to do this and that is called master page you can do that with master pages so if this is my road and I'm returning index.blade.php I have to create a new file and call this again index.blade.php but for example there is another file which is about.blade.php and uh, now I have to create a folder and call this layouts and at this folder I, cre I create a new file and call this master.blade.php okay so I put my main uh, HTML tags here. So HTML, HTML. And here also head. And for example, here comes title. And I name this as project and at the body I want to use different content for about page and index page at the body section okay but firstly I have to include this master page at these pages and for doing that I say extends and I say layouts which means layouts folder go to that folder and after that open up master so notice that I use that sign instead of backslash because Laravel uh, will understand this that uh, this that sign means backslash and means just go to that folder and open up master.play.php then after opening that I say yield so I name this yield content and what does and this do it basically uh, open up a section for you and you name it uh, like content or main or anything else but I named the content so in my index page I can easily say section notice that I'm using at sign before these tags so I have to also close it and this section is named just the same name that I use in master page so it is content so I use this content also in index page and then I can say h1 index page okay now I can copy whole course to about page but this time it is about page okay so if I create a new road also for my about page it loads the about blade.php okay so if I refresh the page as you can see this index page is appearing and basically it loads first uh, this master.blade.php but when it comes to this area it loads this section because I put my h1 tag here inside of this function this section but let's go to the about page also as you can see this one is different from the previous page and it says about page okay you can do this for your title for example at yield 
character so i named it ill and for example at index i can say again at section and title but this time again um, i don't need to write and and section and section because it is uh, only one string and i don't have any uh, i don't know complete data and i can use it just as the second parameter of uh, this section so i say for example index page and again i copy this for about page and i can say about page okay so if i refresh the page it says project about page because i'm on the about road and it is the about page but if i go back to my uh, index page it says project index page and it's returning me the index page okay that's very useful 